Yo, what's up, Breaker fans? This is Rafael from C Manga, and I'm here to review the Breaker New Wave Chapter 93. So, yeah, it, it was a very fast chapter today, and I'll just get right into it. It starts off with um, High Ill fighting that glasses guy, one of the SUC um, captains, and it's pretty much the same as it was. He's basically on the defensive, barely trying to um, dodge this guy. It's like they're running on build the side of buildings and everything. And this guy's just kicking brick walls apart and Hyrule's just about dodging and he's like, Oh gosh, this is this is madness, what's going on? And the other guy starts, um and he's like, What's going on? he's like, How come Jin Lee and them not having contact with me? I feel like something's wrong. He picks up his phone out of his pocket now and it's completely cracked and smashed up and he's like, Oh great. So the other guy starts to mock him now and he's like, oh, it seems like the rumours about you ex um, being as strong as Guy Yu is exaggerated. He's like, you're not very that sh you're not very strong, are you? And then that gets on Hyrule's nerves and he dashes the phone at him, screaming, shut up. He said, well, that, what he's really um, worried about now isn't who he's fighting. He said he's worried about Jin Lee. So yeah, um, it goes to Shi Wen and Jin Lee now on the roof and... Jindy's asking how did he not know that Chum um say he was actually an imposter and it wasn't that Chum Moran girl and the geek guy there with says you can't really blame him because Chum Morang Haru is known for using the bone technique and she's very famous for it because it's very effective it, she can imitate anyone she wants perfectly and it's, um, what do you call it? it, it doesn't matter because regardless of height or proportions, faces, anything, she can imitate that to a T and without anyone even noticing. And she says, oh, you've done your research, but she said, I'm really annoyed because I've been um, studying that say he girl for weeks. And it was that little girl I was talking about before, the glasses. So that that was why we were suspicious of her. She was actually that um, geek looking girl. And she said she'd been studying her for a while, trying to perfectly um, imitate her. And when she and she finally did, but what annoys her is like, how did she even manage to um, find figure out that she was the fake? And she even says that say he has never asked her of anything, um, any favors that directly concern herself. So she's never really been selfish before, and that's what made um, him realize. And then he. She's like, oh, is it something as simple as that? Well, huh, really, that's kind of boring. And then Jin Lee's gotten irritated now and frustrated. She's like, oh, whatever, shut up. And says, oh, let's just fight it out. And she even tells her before, um, before you actually fight, don't just fight. Um, try and get her away from the door. And he's saying to the other guy as well, so we can get the Shin Hup clan up here to help. And she's kind of annoyed, thinking, so what, you don't trust my skills? And she's like, he's like, no, it's not because I don't trust your skills. I don't want you to get hurt. That embarrasses her. And she's like, oh, whatever, fine, do what you want. So she charges forward now. And it's it's quite difficult for her to get close. She said she's more on the defensive right now. And she was, because obviously the whip has a range. And she's saying this girl is really fast with using this whip. And so she's just about dodging um these um swings and what do you call it from the whip and she realizes now she has to change her strategy she says she's got to stop her movements or she's never going to be able to get close or even hit her so she takes her blaze off and wraps it around her arm and then she charges forward again and purposely takes a hit from the thing so it wraps around her arm that that blazer's on so she can stop her movement and then she tries grabbing the whip now with her other hand, but it doesn't work. Um, like before, it was some reason it's slipping. Then Chumran calls her stupid, saying that don't you know that's not gonna work. So in Jin Lee attacks again, decided to try and attack her from behind by somersaulting over her. But in her mid jump, she's um, attacked by Chumran, who whips the whip around her neck, and grips her and then she said I've had enough of you now and said she's tough for you to go and throws her off the roof using the whip um, she went to start mad shouting calling out Ginny and it shows um high ill now is appeared on the scene downstairs he's like what's that Ginny where where and then after he looks up now and he sees her f um, flung off the roof falling and then he starts screaming as well
and then the chapter ends there so yeah as i said man, it was a fast chapter <laughs> really fast kind of felt like i was reading bleach but it was still good none of the less i just wish a bit more would happen like it usually is but i'm not going to complain because i said the, the story's been quite good and consistent for the past few weeks so um i, I shouldn't moan i mean it, there's bound to be short chapters here and there but either way i <laughs> i just wanted something more but uh what, 15 pages is good enough so yeah um I'm assuming now the SUC have pretty much um, have the advantage now. They've they're technically holding back the Shin Shinlock clan. They've got Say He now as a hostage. I'm assuming, and they've got they've, they've kind of boxed in Shi Win and the, none of the Su Sun Wu clans as well. So they have the advantage. So what now? I mean, who's gonna arrive next? That's all we can think. Um, so I'm assuming something bad is going to happen next week i don't think Jin Lee, it's going to be Jin Lee. she's obviously going to get caught by high ilk so yeah that's cool but what else is going to happen is, um <laughs> i mean she wins now defenseless up there so who's going to appear to help him but we'll just have to see what happens next week then i guess so yeah um as per usual if you like the video leave us a like um to rate our video up it helps us out if you enjoyed the video as well, comment and or end the chapter to, you know, voice your opinions, let us know what you thought. Was I talking crap? Um and as usual, subscribe if you um for more content on the channel. I said there's more videos and other um series being reviewed and a lot of videos to look at. So yeah, um I guess I'll see you guys next week for the next break.